Hello everyone, Richard Hart, and I am here with... Maria Omasha Prusakova. Hi Richard. Pleasure to meet you. So Maria reached out, she's a, uh, a representative that uh, you know works to make crypto projects more popular. She's got one that she's representing and she wants to talk about. And when she was introducing herself, uh, she told me that uh, she was an Olympian. So what's that like? Uh, you were an Olympian in Russia, right? Yeah. Uh, so I started uh, snowboarding when I was 12 years old, and I became really good at it quickly. And by the age of 16, I represented Russia in the Winter Olympics in Turin um, in a half pipe. So it was tricks, uh, tricks and half of dome. So basically, I was a, a child athlete. I traveled all over the world, and uh, I was uh, twice champion of Russia. Uh, participated in World Cups, Euro Cups, and I worked a lot with reporters, media at that time, as an athlete, basically, as a star, as a known athlete in Russia. And um, about 14 years later, I found myself working in public relations, but on the side of the media agency. Right. Um, yeah. I keep looking at your neck uh, tie there. It looks like America to me. I see the red, white, and blue. This reminds me of America. Don't take it off because your mic's attached to it. Okay. <laughs> Don't take it off. The uh, mic's on there. Um, yeah, so tell us about the project that you represent. Um, yeah, so one of, uh, one of our projects that we do public relations for is called Particle. Particle is a decentralized marketplace that pretty much anyone can use um, who is using eBay, Amazon, Etsy, or any other platform in the U.S. or around the world to purchase or sell goods. Uh, but with Particle Marketplace, you can do it with crypto. You can use uh, part points, which are currently on 15 exchanges um, in uh, on HitBTC, on Bitrex, and uh, with Bitcoin. So if you have Bitcoin and you want to avoid the fees that Amazon or eBay is charging you, you should go to Particle Marketplace, download it, and start using it. Recently, they were selling Tesla on it. Oh, cool. And how does it work? It works without any intermediary. It is on the blockchain, and there is a special escrow system, meaning that when you want to uh, to buy something, you will have to deposit twice the uh, twice the amount right. that you uh, that, that the good costs, and the other person will also have to deposit uh, the amount of the good. So basically, if the transaction doesn't happen or if the good gets lost, there is no way that um, one of the parties will be uh, will be without the good because okay. of this uh, escrow system. There is no third party. The fees are minimum or non-existing. And it works. Um, it works pretty well, especially cool. for the crypto community who wants to spend their crypto. All right, seems pretty simple. Yeah. eBay, but on crypto, with built-in yeah. escrow. All right, neat. That's, that's a much, it's, there isn't much to ask. I mean, I know, I understand it. I get how it works. Do you know any other projects doing similar things? Uh, yeah. There's a guy that runs something called Open Bazaar which is uh, an open source tour enabled kind of shopping cart that you can use for crypto transactions. Uh, I think the guy that runs it's named Brian Hoffman. But sometimes I don't know if he gets drunk and he posts or whatever, so I had to give him the old blockaroni. Sometimes he gets a little too spicy on his posting. So, uh, but, but I think his project would be similar. Um, I don't think that there's escrow built in. They don't have their own token. Uh, it's really open source shopping cart for Bitcoin, and I think they also support some other cryptocurrencies, perhaps. I mean, in my experience, it's it's hard to kickstart both sides of a market because no one wants to list until there's buyers, and there won't be any buyers until there's listings. And so you have to like heavily invest to fill up at least one side of the market to attract the other side. You know? Yeah, I totally hear you. And the, and the the particle marketplace that they've been building for the past two and a half years. Um, most of the developers are volunteers, just right. as on your project. It's right. really impressive. They're not most, but I have a lot of volunteers. Yeah. They're definitely not most, unfortunately. <laughs> I wish they were. But still, it's great. Just like Monero or Particle, they just, there are people passionate about it and doing it just for the passion and for the good, right. not just looking for money. All right, so like, what's the website? Uh, it's particle.io. But there's no E after particle, right? Doesn't it just end with an L? Yeah. Okay, well that's important. <laughs> so particle with an L at the end, no E. Yeah. Dot I O. All right. So I was confused because there's also I think there's another particle that does like uh, GPU processing kind of stuff. It was E at the end. They had the E at the end. Yeah, I think so. Man. 
guys got to, one of you needs to rebrand. <laughs> well, let's see. Yeah, so there is uh, 9 million hard coins right now. The coins are costing $1 per coin. All right. Uh, we started working with the project on in June, and right. we launched it after the project being completely silent for two and a half years of right. building. And it's held by the Swiss Foundation, and it's all all the money that they raised for the past two and a half years, because of course some of the team members have paid. Right. Um, this was all the community. So the cool. community who bought the coins, who donated, there was yeah. never a real fundraise. And actually, yeah. uh, this autumn they started the real fundraise, and yeah. they're, they're actually thinking how can they raise money to continue building, because the platform is working, but still there is a lot of bugs, yeah. and it's blockchain, right. so they need to be more scalable. Yeah. So it's really, it's really exciting phase to, as a PR agency, to see them grow and sort of like get them out of the dark when nobody knows about it. And now they've been at, at San Francisco Blockchain Week. I'm myself from uh, San Francisco. They've been to Consensus in New York, in Vegas. They're cool. going to Smash. So like we see how the world is knowing about them and they're going to have a booth at most of those conferences. Right. And we hope that people will be using them more and more. Oh, and your concern was that we need to get more people uh, right. right onto the marketplace yep. and over there they have more demand that they can actually like, accommodate oh, okay. why because they've been building this community right. which is uh, incredible community of passionate people it's right. all open source developers people who use the marketplace so the right. people were just waiting when will it work for the past two and a half years so there nice. is about twenty thousand followers so I them are using it. but what i would give them as an advisor to the project as an advice is that they started um, selling everything to anyone so they accept all kind of sellers and right. all kind of buyers right. but if we think to the pioneer and to the best project which exists these days amazon how did amazon start selling books just exactly. one thing exactly yeah. you start with a niche yeah i know what you mean you start with selling books selling yep. computers selling something small targeting this audience and then growing and growing right Gotcha, man. All right, well, everyone now you know about Particle. You know about Masha, the half-pipe Olympian. Um, yeah. You guys already know what I'm doing, so I won't tell you any more about it. Um, yeah, it was good talking to you. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you.